With several peaks towering well over 4,000 feet high, including the highest U.S. peak east of the Mississippi, amazing views in the North Carolina Appalachians are aplenty. And with hundreds of hiking trails and individual trails ranging from a few hundred yards to over a thousand miles long, these North Carolina mountains have a trail for hikers of all experience levels. In this video, we'll take you with us on some of the very best hikes in North Carolina. And don't worry, although these hikes offer some amazing views, they won't require you to spend all day on the trail, as nearly all of the best viewpoints can be accessed in well under an hour. So grab your hiking shoes and come along with us as we take you on five of the top hikes in North Carolina. Hike number one takes us to the highest cliffs in eastern North America, which can be found on Whiteside Mountain near the Georgia and South Carolina borders. The main trail on this 4,900 foot tall mountain is known as the Whiteside Mountain Recreational Trail. All right, we're here and we're gonna do this loop. This loop trail is approximately 1.5 miles long with several overlooks offering stunning views to the south, east, and west. The trail is rated moderate in difficulty. While the trail does include a few steep areas, we agree with this rating and had no trouble completing the loop in under an hour. The trail is known to be heavily trafficked and we did find ourselves sharing the trail with several other hikers during the visit. We did, however, have no trouble finding some room to ourselves by venturing off on some of the side trails. Do be aware, however, that while most viewpoints along the main trail provide railings, the viewpoints which we accessed on the side trails did not. The cliffs at the end of the side trails can be very dangerous if you're not hiking with caution. We had to climb down here to see this view. While visitors in the fall will be able to enjoy the changing of the leaves, visitors in the spring and summer are often rewarded with peregrine falcon sightings. The cost to access the trail is $3 per vehicle and $1 per person, which we found to be a bargain for a hike of this quality. The trail is open daily from dawn to dusk. Our next hike takes us a couple of hours northeast to one of the most iconic sites in all of North Carolina. Located approximately 25 miles southeast of Asheville, visitors will find the famous rock formation located in Chimney Rock State Park. And while the top of Chimney Rock can be accessed easily via bus and elevator, the park has miles of trails with varying difficulty levels as well. In fact, Chimney Rock State Park offers a total of nine trails to explore. Trail lengths range from less than a quarter of a mile to over eight miles, with difficulties ranging from moderate to strenuous. During our visit, we actually hiked on three separate trails, the Outcroppings Trail, Exclamation Point Trail, and Skyline Trail. The three connected trails total 1.6 miles one way. The trails are rated moderate to strenuous, with the strenuous rating resulting from the 800 plus stairs, which are located on the outcroppings and exclamation point trails. You can take the elevator up there, but we are gonna take the stairs. Hikers who are willing to climb all of those stairs will be rewarded with some beautiful viewpoints along the way. If you're interested in seeing more footage of any of these five hikes, including information on accessing the trailheads, check out our full hike and vlog videos linked in the description below. Those hikers who reach the end of the Skyline Trail will be further rewarded with an amazing view of Hickory Nut Falls. While it did take us close to an hour to complete the hike to the falls, we found the hike back to be much quicker and mostly downhill. Park hours vary by season, but from mid-March through early November, visitors can enter the park from 8.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. and can stay as late as 7 o'clock. 
With an entrance price of $17 per adult and $8 per child, this hike was by far the most expensive on this list, but in our opinion, still well worth it. Our third top North Carolina hike takes us to the Rumbling Bald Trail. Like the prior hike on this list, this hike is located within Chimney Rock State Park. But unlike the prior hike, this one is absolutely free. Located just to the northeast of Chimney Rock, the Rumbling Ball Trail offers hikers a completely different hiking experience from the other hikes on this list. The 1.6 mile loop trail is rated as moderate and is relatively flat with only around 340 foot of elevation gain. This trail takes you along the base of the Rumbling Bald Mountain. While you won't experience the amazing mountain vista views that you will on the other hikes on this list, you will experience a wide, well-marked, and well-maintained trail full of lush vegetation and wildlife. What really separates Rumbling Bald from other trails is the massive boulder fields, which attract rock climbers from across the country to put their bouldering skills to the test. And if you aren't into climbing boulders yourself, you can still enjoy marveling at the massive rocks from below. While visitors could easily spend several hours exploring the main loop and the side trails, those who stick to the 1.6 mile loop can easily complete this hike in under an hour. The next hike takes us another hour and a half to the northeast to the Linville Gorge Wilderness Area. Here, hikers will have their pick of over 50 great hiking trails including the final two hikes on this list. The first of these two, and the fourth hike overall, is the Hawksbill Mountain Trail. This out and back trail is approximately 1.2 miles one way, with around 695 foot of elevation gain. Rated at moderate, the hike is relaxing and not too strenuous until the final quarter mile or so, which does become somewhat steep and rocky. I'm breathing pretty heavy, but I think we are almost to the top. We found that the round trip hike could be completed by most hikers in an hour or less, but you'll want to allocate far more time than that for this hike, as once you reach the end of this trail, you may never want to leave. Despite being a relatively short trail, hikers who venture up to the 4,000 foot summit will be rewarded with what may be the best panoramic views in all of North Carolina. Here you'll find seemingly endless 360 degree views, including Table Rock Mountain, Mount Mitchell, and Grandfather Mountain. And on an especially clear day, you may even be able to see the Charlotte skyline, approximately 90 miles away. Here you'll also find some amazing photo ops. Just don't venture too close to the ledge. The Hawksbill Mountain Trailhead is open daily from 7.30 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. from April to December. The road accessing the trailhead is closed from January through March. And just like the Rumbling Bald Trail, the Hawksbill Mountain Trail is 100% free. We are reluctantly leaving Hawksville. Right, so pretty. Pretty the next one. I am, I am. Our fifth and final hiking destination takes us just five miles south of the Hawksville Trailhead, where you'll hike to the chimneys along the Mountain to Sea Trail. Like the Hawksville Trail, this trail can be accessed from April to December. Table Rock is the one we are not gonna do today, but it is on the right side of the parking lot. The one we are gonna do is located on the left side of the parking lot near the restrooms. 
To access this trail, you'll want to follow the trail to Short Off Mountain, as the chimneys are not identified on the sign at the trailhead. At only 1.7 miles round trip and 375 foot of elevation gain, the hike to the chimneys is one of the shortest and easiest hikes on this list. But if you're thinking a short, easy hike can't possibly have some of the best views of any North Carolina hike, think again. While many hikers will choose to make the full 5.6 mile hike to Short Off Mountain, a seemingly endless amount of amazing views can be found on the much shorter hike to the chimneys. And as this hike begins on the rim of a canyon, it takes just a few short minutes before the spectacular views begin. From our experience hiking in North Carolina, we found many hikes to offer amazing viewpoints along the trail. But what separates the chimneys from most other hikes is that spectacular views can be had along the vast majority of the trail. And in case the views from the trail itself aren't good enough for you, there are many large boulders along the trail which you can scramble up for an even better view. This one's a little more sketchy. Yeah, I don't know that I wanna do that. So if you're afraid of heights, the chimneys is probably not the best hike for you. But if you're looking for amazing views without having to commit too much time or energy, the hike to the chimneys is one you won't want to miss. Hey, you made it all the way. That wraps up our list of the top five short hikes in North Carolina. We hope this list helps you to get the most out of your North Carolina hiking adventure. Do you know of any great short North Carolina hikes that you'd add to this list? If so, let us know in the comments. If you're interested in seeing more footage from hiking in North Carolina, we would recommend watching our North Carolina hiking series. We'll make sure to put a link in the video description. If you're interested in more travel content, then be sure to subscribe to our channel and turn the notifications on. Thanks for watching.